Alright, this is Gato 21 slow mo. I'm just gonna break down some little drawing tips and tricks here today. Nothing major, just some small things. Alright, everybody, even when I was young, we always try to draw in all the details all at once, but not taking in the whole picture of the shapes involved to make the whole image. So I'm just gonna run through a couple of quick ones, just so you have an idea, you know, for young people or all the like, you know. Anybody trying to learn how to draw can learn how to draw, you know. But you gotta want, you gotta put yourself out there to learn it. Uh, we'll do some very basic tips here, you know, some basic shapes, you know. I'm gonna take these and we'll use them into, we'll make them into stuff here, really quick, you know, basic, but, you know. Well, I will, I'll break down a car, alright. Basically a car, it's a circle, two circles, rectangle, alright, very basic, can be car, station wagon, SUV, whatever, you know, but you get the idea, alright, so now you're seeing what I'm seeing, I just broke it down the shapes, but now you have something a little bit more. You want to go into details. That's another thing. You can break it down to details. I'll give it some real shape. Give it a hood. Right? We'll give it some doors. Right? Bang. Now you got a car with some doors. Basic, simple, to the point. Next one. I always do as a person. You know, people... Easy done, right? Uh, stick figure. People laugh. It's a good way to get a basic pose is the stick figure. A lot of people don't think about that, but it is. Alright. You do a stick. Now this guy is putting an arm up in the air. So he's reaching up, do the hips, bang. Now, it's kind of squares, right, for the chest. Get lines down, a triangle for the neck. And then you start connecting the dots, some circles or ovals. Attach the body better. You get the traps, right? So now we can make it like a Marvel style comic or something to that effect, right? So it's just taking shapes or taking lines and taking shapes and adding them to it. So we got ovals here for the leg, another oval. We got it squared out here, triangles, just to make a person, right? There are probably some better tutorials out there, but this is mine and the way I'm breaking it down for you. I do it very basic. I try to keep it basic. Because if you can learn from this, you can take this and bring it to anything else. Whether it's a building, you're into architecture, you're into, you know, scenery, landscape, you know, water scenes, anything to that effect. You can take it and take yourself to the next level. Like I'll show you a quick one. This is how I first came up with my logo. That's how we came up with the logo slow mo, right? Came up first, an oval. Basic everyday thing. It's a circle. Right? No beginning, no end. It's continuous. Right? And then the lettering. Not quite as pretty this time. But, to give you the idea, right, do your letters inside, then you block them out. As you block them out, you add, you add some thickness to these, to the outline, to the letters. Right, you give it some depth. You give it some thickness in spots, right. 
as you do that you bring your image more to 2D from 1D the more you wait to do your details the better they show up later All right. I've learned this growing up my mom used to get on me about it all the time she taught me how to draw so you know I hope everybody gets a little bit out of this you know just taking shapes and putting them together you can do anything with shapes you can take the shapes you can elongate them you can make them abstract whatever you can change the shape that's one great thing about drawing is you can take anything that exists and you can just exaggerate it make it yours reown it whatever reimagine what it is and what it could be under your mind that's what it's all about art and stuff like that just get out there take it you know take it and make it what you want it if people like it they'll like it if they don't well hey you know but the thing is enjoy the process of actually creating the art and as you go along you can take it to the next level on each additional drawing I started probably when I was four years old I found some old sketchbooks I'll post some pictures here and there but for now this is just a basic just on shapes and where you can use them and how alright yo this is Gato 21 slow-mo you know have a good day later peace out